What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video here on Loud and Proud. So very, uh, very big day here today. So the winner of the Hellcat is actually going to be showing up this morning to pick up that car. So we got to do a couple things really quick. I've got to move the OBS forward because he's bringing a trailer to trailer of the car back because he said that there's a good chance they get a good amount of rain on the way back home. And he said that he's not really fond of the idea of driving that car back through the rain. Better safe than sorry type of deal. So he's going to bring a truck and trailer and he's going to haul the car back. So we're going to be going to move the OBS 73 Ford and then on top of that run the car through the car wash just to be sure cars got brand new tires only 9,500 miles on it it's a 2018 we'll give you a little bit better look around the car here in just a minute but let's go move that OBS Ford and another fun fact is we should be picking up one of the Whistling diesel trucks this Friday give or take I don't know if it's gonna be exactly Friday I just sent him a text to see if Friday works but I mean it could be Wednesday or Thursday or Friday or this Saturday. I don't know. It just depends on what works for him as well. But the plan is to be able to pick that dually up this week. And then once I have the dually so that I have a truck I can use the trailer with, um, I'm going to be dropping the OBS Ford off to get the paint chips fixed. So with this truck, cash in every single order ended on August 8th. However, we did introduce a new deal. This is a bonus period. So every $1 is now five entries instead of one. And every order over $25 gets cash still. $5 minimum. And it's gonna be random cash amounts. So you're gonna be five, 10, 15, 20, 50, 100, 200. It just kind of depends. It's just random. Every order over $25 gets $5 minimum. And just so you guys know, we aren't a business that like will set like a limit and be like, oh, so we're only budgeting out this much cash in orders for this week. So if we get down to the last 10 orders and there's only $10 left, they all get one buck. That's not the way we do it. If we say every order gets cash and every order over 25 gets five bucks minimum, if we run low on cash that we have on hand, guess what? We go to this thing called the bank and we get more cash and we give you more cash. That's how we're gonna do it. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Link is in the description below if you want to enter to win this truck plus five thousand dollars cash do not waste any time though because this giveaway is already about a third of the way done if you want to get in every one dollar is five entries to win got mr bear here he's been he's been a little bit of a handful i'm not gonna lie so he was pretty well trained and he still listens to his commands but only if he has a shot collar on and you give him a little zap just to let him know hey listen or else type of deal um, other than that, I mean, when he doesn't have that collar on, he knows it, man. He tears up everything. But anyway, so let's show you around the Hellcat real quick. So we've got the red SRT key right here. We're going to vacuum this thing out, though, first real quick and give it a quick wipe down with some Armorel wipes. But it is a, like I said, it's a 2018 Hellcat. It is, of course, the automatic. Beautiful, clean car. Super low miles for the most part. I mean, not ultra low, but 9,500 miles, which for this car is really not, not that bad. My dad's 2016 392 that he picked up had 26,000 miles on it when he bought it. And those cars get a little bit more daily driven than one like this. But for the most part, the mileage on this thing is really, really not that bad because when I picked it up, it only had 7,500 and I put 2,000 miles on it. Let's get this thing started up here because you guys need a good cold start because why not? And I'm going to have to vacuum this thing out here before I take it to the wash. It's going to be loud. Oh my gosh. Well, everybody, Jeff Hughes is here. There are your three keys. Right. Two of them are extra fun, one's a little bit less fun. <laughs> okay. But they're all a good time, so go check out the car, man. All right. Oh, man. Oh, that's nice. Oh, man. This is wild. Starter on up. Yeah. Whopping 9,500 miles on it. <laughs> oh man. We are in the Hellcat right now. We've got Jeff here. Is this your first time literally like getting ready to just take it straight down the road oh, in a Hellcat? Yeah. Oh yeah. 
definitely. What's the feeling right now? Because there's a lot of people that are probably wondering, what's it like to feel like oh, I have a Hellcat? Because there's a lot of people that just, they dream of it, but they don't have oh, one. Man, you I've know? always dreamed of it. It's anxious. I'm anxious. Since 2015, I'm guessing, right? When yeah, it came out. 2014 <laughs> when I heard they were coming up. <laughs> when you heard the rumors. Yeah, we'll go left and then there's just a nice straight, straight open road. All right. Brakes work really good though on oh, these yeah. things. Those Brembo brakes are awesome. Oh yeah. They're, they're, they work really well. Yeah. All kinds of settings here. You can click the SRT button, then it'll show you like what power you're using, all this other stuff. Like if you go to sport, for example, gives you sport, sport transmission, sport suspension, all this stuff. Okay. And it's pretty gnarly because oh, it, it takes off your traction control as you can see in your gauge cluster oh so you can do sick burnout so like <laughs> if you so... pinned it right now it would just smoke the tires and probably get a little nasty but oh man i mean it, it's crazy and then you got your performance gauges and you can oh, actually really? see um it'll give you like a printout like if you're going down the drag strip okay. like your zero to 60 times how much horsepower you use your max torque all that stuff like it's crazy it gives you oh, everything man almost like you hook up a computer and you get all your stuff. So it tells you right now how much horsepower, um, your G-forces, your current gear, you can do a, a dyno, how your engine's doing. Um, there's all kinds of stuff, dude. I mean, it's just crazy. It is crazy. Wow. It's pretty advanced. Yeah. I didn't even know I had that until my dad bought a 392 and he's like, hey, you know you have all these performance gauges, right? And I was like, no, I had no idea. He's like, yeah, get in there, click SRT, and go to your performance pages tab up in the corner. He's like, it's pretty crazy. Just the sound of it. Oh my God. It makes you smile, doesn't oh, it? Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> it's crazy. If you guys could understand the vibe coming off this dude right now and how happy he is, you'd be smiling just as much. I mean, it's it's a dream come true. I know when I bought it, I was like, this is the most fun vehicle I have ever sat in, ever drove, like hands down. And uh, he's taking it home. Loop that we basically take with all the giveaway winners when they get their vehicle for the first time. They're like, hey, let's go on this little two minute loop. Is that what all the, the track marks are? Well, yeah, that was from, uh, that was from a truck. <laughs> But yes, you'd be correct. Uh, <laughs> this is basically like a back road drag strip right here. That's pretty much what we use it for. <laughs> it looks like it. Yeah. Oh man. Now you want to drive it home, don't you? Oh yeah. <laughs> He's got a trailer, but I think he wants to drive it now. The whole nine hours. Yeah. It might not take you nine hours in this though. That's, oh no. That's the sad thing. When you're driving, you're going to be thinking, I could be going so much faster. <laughs> yeah. He's leaving. He's got his car. Any last word? I'm Jeff Hughes from Kansas City, and I just want a 2018 Hellcat. This is uh, the real deal. I'm taking it home right now. I'm going to post plenty of videos for everyone to see on there. So. Absolutely. Well, you enjoy that car, man. All right. I appreciate it. Safe trip home. Yeah, thank you. There they go. He's off with his new Hellcat. Well guys, Jeff is on his way home with his new 2018 Challenger Hellcat and he's going to have a lot of fun with that car. I can already tell he's one of those guys that has an appreciation for those cars. Like he's just always wanted one. Since before they came out, he's like, dude, since 2014, I have wanted this car. So he's just one of those guys that's just gonna really have a deep appreciation for it, which I'm super excited for him about that. Baby's like kind of thinking about waking up. Stay asleep just a little bit longer. We're gonna slow the swing down. We have been shipping out a lot of stuff ourselves and here's the current situation. So we're still waiting for shelving to show up. If it doesn't show up soon, we're just gonna have to go buy some new stuff because we're not gonna be able to wait for it much longer and get this organized until we can get a building to do our fulfillment in. Like I said, this is something that we're probably gonna have to do short term in our own house, which I really ordinarily I'm not a fan of doing that just because it, well, it takes up like a third of our downstairs space. So um, it's not ideal, but we are shipping stuff so much faster now. Like all this stuff, this is just stuff that was ordered yesterday and it's already going out today. Anything before August 3rd, all those orders are still supposed to be fulfilled and they will be fulfilled by the fulfillment center that used to do our fulfillment stuff. For example, if you ordered something for the last giveaway, 
and you've been waiting on it a long time, I understand the frustration, which is why we're dealing with this mess in the process. Even though we don't have the building yet, we're trying to get our done ourselves as fast as possible because we want everybody who orders from our new website layout, from our current giveaways, from now on, from August 3rd, which is when our most recent giveaway started, any order that comes in from August 3rd and on from that point forward, we are fulfilling ourselves. So if you ask a question about your order, we can actually tell you what's going on and tell you, hey, your products went out today, it's going out tomorrow. Uh, you know, those products are going to show up this Friday and then they'll be out. You should have it within the next eight days. You know, like stuff like that versus like, I have no idea somebody else is responsible to get those orders out to you. Like, I know it's been a long wait. You're just going to have to wait longer. We don't want to have to say that anymore. We don't want to have to basically not know what's happening with our stuff and not see it go out. This makes me feel good that I'm going to see, you know, there's probably there's probably a hundred items in there. A lot of them are koozies and decals and stuff like that. But a lot of packages just just from like yesterday, they're already going out, you know? And that's something that we have not been able to offer for several months. Actually, over a year and a half now, we've pretty much used a different fulfillment center and we never really had an issue. Most orders were delivered in like two weeks or under. But then in the last six months, it really turned into like a huge problem. And most of the issues are not their fault. It was more of an issue of, you know, the governors of each state. And for example, our fulfillment center was in Michigan. Michigan had it really bad and really crappy and they were all treated, all businesses were just treated really poorly. And so a lot of time for a couple months straight, they were down to 50% staff. You know what happens when you're down to 50% staff and you're responsible for fulfilling thousands of orders for multiple different companies? It creates a problem. And then you know what happens? the business owners that are having that fulfillment center do their orders for them. I was one of those people that had a fulfillment center doing this stuff for me because I didn't want to do this in my house, but now it's basically going to force me to buy a building so we can actually hire our own employees and do it all ourselves. I didn't want to have to do that, but now I'm going to because I want you guys to have the best service possible. But then anyways, when those customers have a bad experience because they're waiting forever, we get looked at as the bad guys like ship my stuff, ship my stuff. And like, I get it, it's frustrating and that's a problem, which is why we're trying to fix it so that from this point on, there's no more long waits. But if you ordered before August 3rd, I hate to say it, but it's just gonna come in when it comes in. And that's just, it's a bummer, but that's just the way it is. So since the order came through when they were the ones responsible, they are still the ones that has to ship it. I don't just have your stuff sitting around here in a box ready to go and just like not shipping it out. That's why we're trying to fix the issue so that from this point forward, we can have happy customers, good service and take care of you guys the way that we want to take care of you. And another thing that I want to share with you is Reagan is actually doing another giveaway. It's live right now. I'll show you what it is. It's a little bit different. We haven't done one like this before. And so I'm going to let her kind of explain what it is. And I think a lot of you guys might really like this. Okay. So we're going to take a little break from the truck. I know a lot of my fans or customers have builds that they're working on. So I thought it'd be awesome to offer either like all new lighting all the way around on their vehicle or one of the Pioneer flip out radios that are a double den that I have for Rosine and I've also put in Black Beauty. So we have on the website just example pictures up here. Obviously this is like the set that I had for Jaws or this is the type of radio that I put in two of my trucks already. I've also thought about if you know if you necessarily don't want either of those just giving you $500 cash and putting it towards any part of your build. That's really what this kind of is to do is to help them build their truck if they already have them and you know they don't want to start a whole new project yeah and here's this cool thing too <laughs> let's say they don't even have a truck let's say they just have yeah. a car this you can pretty much do whatever you want these are just like example yeah. headlights and taillights or radio all she's saying is it could be like you know cosmetic lighting accessories or a sound system for your truck but it doesn't necessarily have to be a truck and it does not have to be a cat eye duramax those are just like sample sample products of an idea of what she's talking about now if you have like a newer fifth gen or fourth gen you're gonna have obviously a limit of how much you can spend on lighting yeah. because it'd be like ridiculous it'd be like a thousand dollars for like headlights just for the front like yeah. just for the headlights not for taillights or third brake yeah. lights so it's gonna be like a 500 hundred dollar cap basically what's yeah. the entry amount just so they have an idea so since it's a every one dollar is one entry right now okay. and that only goes till friday so you, right now you only have five days to enter to win one of those options so if you want to enter dieselbabegear.com her link is always in the description below Every $1 is one entry and you only have until August 14th, this Friday, and then it's over. So we're gonna do this real quick and try to wrap this up. Yeah, let's call Jacob real quick and see what he has to say. 
Hi, this is Reagan. Is this Jacob? Yes, this is. Congratulations on winning Jaws. How do you feel? <laughs> oh, I, I am so excited. I don't know what to feel. <laughs> yeah, my, uh, the guy who does our sweepstakes, he's like, yeah, we have a really speechless winner, but so happy for you. Well, thank you very much. Yeah. I got Malachi on here, too. He's What's up, Jacob? <laughs> hey, how's it going? Going good, man. How are you? <laughs> Oh, I'm doing great. You ready for a Duramax? Yes, I've been waiting for so long to get one. <laughs> and that guy called me, I couldn't believe it. That's awesome. Yeah, we actually just gave away our Hellcat today, and the guy the guy was like driving it, just smiling. He's like, yeah, I don't even know what to say. He's like, I've wanted one of these since the reveal in 2014. And he's like, yeah. this is just surreal to actually be able to have this vehicle. I'm sure it'll feel fairly similar. So like, whose videos do you watch more? <laughs> oh, shush. <laughs> well, I started out watching you, Malachi, um, for probably two or three years now, probably since you ever started the channel. And then when you guys got together, I started watching her videos. And then when you started to give away that Duramax, that LMN, I was like, I've got to enter into that. <laughs> so I tried to enter, I didn't get lucky there. But uh, when Reagan, started to give this Duramax away, I was like, well, there's no hurt in just trying it out. And then when I got that call, I, I about fell over from a heart attack. <laughs> I was so excited. Yeah. You know what's funny is the guy that won the Hellcat, so he's like, I've never entered a giveaway, ever. And you always get these crazy stories and then it, you know, you feel bad for the guys that enter every single giveaway and you're just like hoping that they win one because like they're such loyal customers, you know. It's just complete, it's luck of the draw, that's the thing. But this guy's like, dude, it was like 11 o'clock at night the last day and I'm just like, man, everybody tells me these things are a joke, it's a scam, you know, he's like, I'm just gonna buy something. He's like, so I bought a couple t-shirts real quick and he's like, I kid you not, a week later I get this call, I'm like, you gotta be joking. Like, I might need yeah. to buy into the Powerball or something. <laughs> like he buys yeah. one thing and then he wins a Hellcat. He's like, I, I've never entered a sweepstakes before. He's like, it was just the craziest thing. It is crazy. I went home and I was talking to my parents. I was like, you're not gonna believe who I got a phone call from today. <laughs> and they're like, are, are you serious? Like, is it real? I was like, this is a hundred percent real. Like, yeah. I know these people. They really do give away trucks and cars to their uh, subscribers and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. And I mean, it it was. They couldn't believe it either. Were you at the whistling diesel meet? We gotta ask. <laughs> no, I was no. not. I like all three. I like Power Stroke and Cummins, but yeah. Duramax is my dream truck to get. So yeah, well, it sounds really good, and well, you'll probably be able to see whistling diesel trucks when you come up and get Jaws, because Malachi will. Have yeah. Did you know that I'm buying them? both of his trucks? <laughs> yeah, I've been uh, looking at your story on Instagram, and uh, <laughs> you get the third gen and the first gen. Yep. Thank okay. you very much. Thank you. Have you a good take day. care, Jacob. <laughs> you too. Bye -bye. But I'm going to do my outro and then you okay. can film a separate outro. How's okay. that sound? Well, guys, thanks for watching Rose24. Stop. Can't wait to meet you, Jacob, even though it's her giveaway, her truck. We both know you like watching my videos. Stop. So, I mean, there's, kind of, the a, Duramax, there's kind of a competitive like thing going on between us, you know? I literally give him all my tricks and stuff. Who's he giving away me. Who's giving away more trucks? Okay, but... Who's get, actually... But, Who's given away the most trucks, other than Diesel Brothers, in the diesel giveaway realm? This guy. Who helped you get the entries calculator on your website? A web designer. No, I did. You what? <laughs> Anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you want to enter to win that OBS Power Stroke, that beautiful white one, we are getting the paint chips fixed, so don't worry about that. Other than that, the truck is completely rust free. It's beautiful, low mileage, 7.3, comes with five grand, and every order over $25 gets a minimum $5 cash in their order. Other than the five bucks, it could be all random amount. Don't miss out on that opportunity. That ends on August 15th. And then the cash and orders thing is probably just going to be done. But if you wanna get that deal, don't waste any time. Otherwise, every $1 is five entries and you could be winning that truck. Thank you guys so much. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.